right, welcome to the lab 12, I Love Cheese. In this lab, we're going to practice a few things that I've put in the week 12 folder. We're going to practice adding this font and that. They're all three the same font. We're going to practice adding that font to this website so that we can use a special font that doesn't appear a lot on websites. And then we're going to add another font using a different method, and it will be the font for these three navigation things. We are going to practice a linear gradient that goes from top to bottom, as you can see in this background. We are going to practice a drop-down menu. And we're going to practice using an internal scroll bar. So this scroll bar here is intended to scroll through this information. Not this, right? You wouldn't want the scroll bar to make your navigation disappear. So it's only this text that will scroll. Um, and as usual, I'll take a look at the largest element first, the background, and we'll work from there. Let's check out what we have in the file here. There's I Love Cheese Lab. You've got your Assets folder, and in there you've got your CSS. I've added the normalize and a styles.css for you. You can see I put the box sizing border box on it for you, the clear fix just in case we need it. I set a body font for um, Arial, and I set your header to align center, and I set the footer information in there. You also have a fonts folder, which is empty for now. You have an images folder, which is empty for now. You have this uh, cheese final result. This has instructions. So it's just sort of giving you the information that you're going to need to create this uh, website, like the stops here for the gradient, which is probably where I'll start. Um, and then you have this final result, which is really just that same image without the instructions. And then I did put in an index.html for you. Um, so we will start by putting that background gradient on, and let's get at that. 